you can make any statement in this world if you put fair enough at the end of it, because you're giving that person an out, mm -hmm. right? And this is, this is something that leaders need to realize. Like, hey, I, I'm, I'm gonna need you, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, here's the expectation, Kyle. You haven't been here on time. We gotta have you here on time. The, the, the business does not run if you're not here. Um, so I'm going to need you to make sure that you're here by nine o'clock and I'm going to be checking to make sure you're here by nine o'clock, uh, every day. So I'm going to need you, we're going to need to have at least three weeks go by where you're showing up on time at nine o'clock and I'm going to check on you every day. Fair enough. You're giving that person an opportunity to go, well, no, that doesn't work for me. And you have to be co confident enough as a leader when they say that doesn't work for me, for you to say what, got it. What's a good next step then? Well, what do you mean? I just communicated to you that the operation does not run if you are not here in your desk at nine o'clock. I've given you an opportunity to where we're gonna monitor you. I, I hate to do it, I know you hate to do it, but I, I ha also have priorities with the business, right? But what's your thoughts? Right. What's a good next step for me, right? And if that person's like, well, I freaking quit, that probably was never a situation you were gonna fix anyways. But what you can't do is what's so popular in 2023 is be, Passive aggressive and wishy washy. That right. doesn't work for pilots. It doesn't work for firefighters. It doesn't work for race car drivers and it doesn't work in business. Right. And I really appreciate it if you get here on time. 